Blocked extra point after a Bucks three and out. Dallas Clark is no! head on by Tanar Jackson. Good hit, clean hit. Dallas Manning. Just absolutely. It's two out of three on third down. Play action fake on a draw play. And Manning throws the ball downfield. It's intercepted. Picked off. Buccaneers have the ball. Jackson to the 40. Jackson to the 50. Jackson to the 40. Flag zone to the 30. Jackson tackled at the 22. His first career NFL pick. He's out of Syracuse. And he picks off Peyton Manning. So it's up to Quinn Gray now in his first career start in the fourth quarter to lead a comeback. And on the rollout, he finds Reggie Williams, who hangs on. Porter takes, drops the pass, standing at the goal line, fires over the middle. It's intercepted at the 30-yard line. Picked off by Tenard Jackson. Jackson at the 20, at the 15, at the 10. And it's a touchdown, but they're going to say that he was down. They're going to roll Jackson down on contact after the interception. 60% of his passes, one back, and that's Clinton Portis. And they'll run Clinton Portis. Still a bootleg play by Campbell. Throws the ball upfield and slipping down. So, oh, fumble football. It's picked up by the Buccaneers. It is Brian Kelly. Lamar, it's Jackson, Tenard Jackson, 28 at 25. And the Bucks gobble up the fumble. Santana Moss trying to get another yard or two. Has the ball stripped away. Brian Kelly will go with him. Pump fake. Hand off to Clinton Portis on a draw play. He's hit from behind it. Fumble football. Picked up. Donard Jackson again, and the Buccaneers have it inside the team. They get up on first down. Down the backfield, that's Forte. Hit hard, gets down to the 27-yard line. Another Bears first down. Cato June took him down. They're going to run these guys off, Sam. Two wide receivers going to clear it out. Forte just gets out in the flat for a nice pickup. On third and nine, Jake steps up in the pocket. He's got time and finally has a pass in and out of the hands. Tenard Jackson picks it off for Tampa, still going, and Jackson's inside the 15. It looked like Steve Smith had it. Jackson was in the right place at the right time. There is a flag down on the play. But Jake DeLone had all kinds of time here. Stands right in that pocket right there, all kinds of guys all around him. Gets rid of this ball here. It's Dante Rosario there. Bounced off of his hands right into Tenard Jackson's hands. Said the safeties would be active today. After the interception and after the ball was dead. Because built into this defense are natural collision points. When they funnel the receiver into the interior of this defense, right here, Tenard Jackson's going to come and put a hit on Steve Smith. You see Steve Smith's already taking his eyes off the ball because he's anticipating that hit. He knows it's coming. From the 10 moving left, Tyler Thigpen at quarter will feed the ball. They'll run to the near side. Bucks call a fumble football. It's loose. It's loose. It's picked up by who? Buccaneers got it. Buccaneers got it to the two-yard line. Buccaneers to our Jackson comes up with a football. How about that? It's first down and goal. Tampa Bay Buccaneers. There's a lead shadowing Smith. Third and seven. Jake DeLone's pass, and it's intercepted. Intercepted by Tenard Jackson. Touchdown, Bucks. This looks like too deep coverage. So it's man-to-man -man underneath with two safeties. Watch Tenard Jackson, the first guy I circled in your screen. When Steve Smith starts inside, he heads towards Steve Smith's area and follows him to the football. Watch Jackson. He's going to move this way and then to the football as he reads the crossing route by Musin Muhammad. There's the pick, and he's off to the end zone. Throws it back of the end zone, and it is intercepted. It's a pick by Jackson. Let's go back and watch Tom Brady. Randy Moss top of the screen. He's double covered on the play. But quick pressure inside makes Brady step up. And look at Moss. What an adjustment by him. But the throw's a little shorter than Tom Brady wants. But most of all, just a tremendous play by Jackson. Rodgers 
Nobody coming open. And that pass tipped and intercepted. Being brought back by Tenard Jackson. Heading for the end zone. Touchdown! That needs to step up to the plate and, and, and play with some nastiness. Intercepted on second and 16. And that's Jackson, Tanar Jackson, with the interception in the red zone. Eight and seven, won't be going to the playoffs, could finish with a nine and seven record. Here's Weems inside the five. And a good return, and a flag goes down, and so is the ball jarred loose. And it's recovered by Tampa Bay. Big hit, but... Like... Number 52, that penalty is declined. First down, Tampa Bay. It's a big hit by the... Had to substitute for him after rushing the passer. Ryan. Intercepted by Tanar Jackson. How about that for a rally breaker? Tanar Jackson. Watch this. Look at Tanar Jackson. Now, when watch what Matt Ryan does when he goes back in the pocket. He tries to move him by looking that way. Tanar Jackson takes just a small cheat step, but doesn't really move off of the spot. See, Matt Ryan thinks he's moved him with his eyes and his head, and then he comes back to his primary receiver. But Tanar Jackson doesn't buy it, and he makes the interception. Third and eight. In and out of the hands and picked off by Jackson. Meacham couldn't hold on, but Jackson could. You watch here. Really nice job by Khalid getting under it, and then Jackson shows his athleticism by gathering the ball while keeping his feet in bounds. You know, you miss this athleticism. You don't have it on the field. This guy is he's crafty. He's Esther athletic. comes in motion into the backfield off the fake end around. The screen intended for Barber picked off Tanar Jackson. Playing it only his second game for the Bucks this season. Had an interception in his season debut last week after he was reinstated by the commissioner. And Jackson returns it 42 yards. I don't know how he does this. You know, last week and then follows it up this week again. I mean, with an interception after being out for over a year. But Marion Barber, you got to make this catch. You just got to make the catch. It, it gets deflected. It goes up in the air. It's going to be a difficult catch, but you got to make that catch on the screen. I, I watched Tenor Jackson on film and was absolutely blown away by how well he played last week in his first game back in over a year. And for Jing, who inactive today for the Titans. Third and 11, pressure put on. Here's the screen to Javon Ringer. And Ringer loses the ball. And Tanar Jackson picks it up for Tampa Bay. Big turnover with just under a minute to go in the half. And the fourth turnover of the game. Ringer, in what looked like an effective screen pass, lost the ball. And Tanar Jackson recovers it well just old-fashioned hustle by Rondé Barber he rushes the quarterback turns around sometimes you just have to hustle and good things happen this guy has a knack for making plays he intercepts the ball he sacks quarterbacks right there a great hustle play pops the ball out right into the arms of Tanar Jackson outstanding play by Rondé Barber